quick coffee, quick Skype with Mr. Max tuning and Omar talking Kaizen. Uh, talk about programming, trying to get this program set up so we can bench 315 for you guys. Coffee. First time I had cold brew in a bottle from Starbucks. It was delicious. Welcome to the video, ladies and gentlemen. I am here in Los Angeles. Uh, landed yesterday. Um, checked in and all that to this dope Airbnb in Little Tokyo. I'm down here uh, with the Barbell Brigade family. Uh, Evan and Deem should be on their way here. Um, we got some photo shoots. They're dropping a new line of stuff coming soon, so stay a lookout for that. Um, yeah, photo shoot, video shoot, lifting weights, hanging out, exploring Los Angeles a little bit, trying to get back on my lifting and my diet. Lifting in New York, as you guys saw in the last uh, video, was decent. Um, I got two or three good training sessions in during that trip, but my diet was shit. So um, I'm gonna try to eat a little bit better down here. Bart's obviously dieting, uh, so that makes it a little bit easier. Um, that's it. So the guys are coming here. We're going to go explore LA. Today's more of a photo shoot, uh, kind of lifestyle outside. So a couple different outfits, uh, exploring little Tokyo a little bit, which I've never really been around. Went to a uh, food out here once. And then uh, I think he said we're heading to Melrose, which I've never really been to. So we'll see what that looks like. Come along with me. If you're new, subscribe, like the video. Enjoy today, my friends. I'm going to shower. I'm going to get this beautiful body ready for the photo shoot. Then we're going to bounce. Time to explore. A goodie. A goodie. A goodie. A little hotter than I expected down here. Wrapped up the photo shoot. Three o'clock, time to eat some food. Cool area, but hot as shit. Bunch of cool graffiti. Nadim killed the game as always. And I sat in some homeless piss. Now we're gonna go get some Argentinian steak. Fall off the plate, sorry, sorry. Successful day, successful shoot. I think that's gonna wrap it up. It's probably 5.30. I'll literally probably just chill here, watch some YouTube, write some emails, maybe turn on a movie, try to go to bed early. Uh, tomorrow I think we're heading over to Bart's house uh, since he's got the little one, the little baby. Uh, we won't be able to train until, or except for at his house together. So we're going to go over there, train, and then I got a seminar. So hopefully I'll get to go to bed early, sleep in early, and I'll catch you guys in the morning whenever I wake up or head over to Bart's house. Night, night. I guess what are we doing? One? Yeah. Thank you. I'm not even gonna go make any salads. I gotta work. That was good, right? Slow morning. Hammered some emails, hung out, drank some coffee. Just grab a bite to eat because in an hour we're heading to Barquan's house. Mr. Barquan's house. Uh, film in real quick. A workout. I'm gonna get a workout in, film it for the Barber Brigade channel. Um, and then we're heading to Barber Brigade because now I got a seminar. Uh, first seminar of this style where. Uh, only having like 20 or 30 people and I'm gonna try to get like shit maybe 10 minutes hands-on with every single person there where I've done a seminar like that kind of back in the day But majority of them are so many people that we can't really straight coach uh, even this one in New York uh, from the past vlog you guys saw that um, We lifted we answered questions. There's probably 120 people and then uh, I wanted to go help and coach but then everyone had pictures or personal questions or whatever so I kind of got crowded into a corner where um, Coaching is, is my roots, that's what I do, so uh, tonight should be fun, help some people squat bench dead uh, a little bit better. LA, I don't know what's going on. How are we doing pause squats? I am. Rambo did a pause squat. I'm doing pause squats right now. I'm gonna do this. I'm safe. I'm lifting with the, the Asian Stallone. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> Close. 
Cool little workout at Bart's house. I'm not feeling quite myself in the gym, although I hit a decent PR last week. I'm um, just tired. Uh, I mentioned a little bit in the past. I deal with some anxiety here and there. Um, so keep me up at night or wake me up early. Uh, and it's been going on for maybe a week or two. So not feeling my greatest internally, uh, which obviously uh, plays a role in how you lift, sleep, recover uh, externally. Uh, and I can be real with you guys. Uh, hopefully, just be open. I've never tried to lie or uh, tell you guys anything that I am not. And although I, I am excitable when the camera's on, uh, it's 100% me for every podcast and every video I've ever done. I uh, just tend to turn it up a couple notches with the cameras on. But it uh, doesn't mean that I can't be 100% uh, transparent um, when the camera's on. It's kind of my job. My job is to coach, entertain, be energetic, um, communicate. And uh, so that's why I'm in the car right now. Nadim's in there finishing up with Bart. I just gonna need to recoup uh, personally, mentally a little bit because um, now we have the seminar in about an hour uh, and I have to like turn it on again. And I guess that's kind of what drains me um, as a human. And, and some people can go, go, go. And some people can travel and, and be happy all the time and be energetic and be smiling and cracking jokes. Uh, and I mentioned it before, you know, I, I consider myself quite ex uh, introverted where to me, it, introverted means that I gain my energy from being alone. Um, I recover from being alone. And extrovert people gain energy from being around people, and that's how that's why people, you know, certain people go out every single weekend because they they get drained during the week and they uh, build their energy back up by going out and partying. I'm I'm quite the opposite. Although I'm a little bit louder and and I may be social, uh, I'm very introverted. I like to be alone as much as I can, to be honest. So uh, I'm gonna chill here for a little bit, recoup. Then we're going to Barbara Brigade. I'll uh, maybe have a little more caffeine and then cool seminar set up today. So. I'm going to try to coach and actually help as many people as I can. Not just like talking about people, not just trying to talk, not just trying to sell shit. I'm really trying to help as many people as I can. And if, the, if that's going to take uh, videos four times a week or if that's going to take seminars once a month, um, actually helping 20 you know, to 30 people a day, um, doing more free Kaizen programs or, or uh, hopefully affordable Kaizen programs to help and reach as many people as I can, I definitely will. Uh, pulled about 545 for five. Felt really heavy. Paw squats went okay. Uh, accessories showed me how out of shape I am. But uh, we will rebuild. We will recoup. And we will continue to push on, my friends. So I'll see you guys at Barbell. Deadlifts, I think we can do on the ground if we have a bumper. Right, team? So if you're going to deadlift, we'll just do it on the ground in this area. But just get a bumper first and we're not the ground. So uh, literally, uh, just go a hair wider. Yeah. We're just trying to get it right here on your window. Okay. Another thing, uh, just want to right away, you do have a big ass, uh, but you also have a little uh, heart. Hi, I'm Silent Mike. Just kidding, I'm Silent Ren. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm Silent Ren. I'm here at the seminar that I'm teaching today. Um, these are all the people that came out here to come and check out my seminar because I'm a really good lifter, right? I'm a really good lifter, right? Yep. So. So people are here to check out my seminar and I'm uh, critiquing them because people love my advice. Um, like this guy right here, he wasn't able to, to um, get lift 425 until today. Until I was like, hey, you can deadlift 425. So what is he doing? Oh, uh, ju you just missed it. You just missed it, but he did deadlift. I believe it's 425. I can't math. I don't know. What do I know? I'm Asian. Um, these people came out here to see me too. They're like, we need to come see Silent Ren. Um, so they're out here. Uh, is this how I'm supposed to like put it out here this far, right? Um, and this guy barely squatting the bar today, and now he's at 225. Like, come on! Like, I'm making miracles happen today. People don't realize that. People need to know that. Like, if I touch them, if they're around me, they're gonna like get really strong. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I get that?
get that for you? Oh. For your looking vlog? Dude, this is behind the scenes, right? <laughs> 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 this is PG. This is the real this is the real film, bro. Oh, like, oh, oh, what's going on? <laughs> I'm Solomon Mike, yo. I wonder why that uh, fuck Nadim thing came about, huh? I wonder why. Is he a right? fucking dickhead? I'm the nicest guy ever. Dude, stop being so fat, dude. Dude, look at this. Dude. Tell me you're not, you don't want that. Dude, you're so fat. If you're gonna eat one today, then you're I'm fat too. I'm not gonna too. eat one. Uh, you're not gonna eat one? So I've been doing heck of good. We're on a, we're on a roll. We're sticking Didn't he just say he was gonna get one? Oh, no, yeah, was that was you. Did. That was just me egging you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was me egging you. You don't need to egg us on. We're gonna get one. Bora, what have you been doing today? I'm gonna get a turtle Suzuki. What is this your first time out of the house? Is this like is this like dad's night? Dad's first boy night? Yeah, dude. So okay, this morning I took uh <laughs> babies. Yeah. Have you been out? Yeah, yeah I took Taika to uh No I mean with doctor. No baby stuff. Oh no, no, no. This is like this, this is boy's it. night. Dude, this is your first dad's yeah, yeah, night. Yeah, yeah, that's true, yeah. Hey babe, we're gonna go out with the guys tonight. Is that cool? <laughs> that's like golf. Yeah. Yeah. This is your first dad's night. Bro. Yeah, yeah, that's true actually. Yeah. Did we go out yesterday? I said I said Bart, what do you been doing? Well Taika and Taika. <laughs> <laughs> it took him to the pediatrician. How'd it go? Fine. Uh, so he's uh, in the 98th percentile in terms of length. So there's only two percent of babies that are bigger than him at his age. I think he's gonna be Brian Shaw or what? Uh, I don't so. uh, it's uh, gonna stop. <laughs> but he's uh, he's right on track. He's uh, like nine nine pounds and six ounces right now. He was born around nine. Uh, around, just around nine. So he gained a little bit of weight. Yeah. He's right on track. So his macros has been on point. Yeah, even my biggest problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, and uh, so he's really healthy, everything's good. Amazing. He has good hip mobility. Like, they always like press the knees and they push it back to see how far they go. Hip mobility's good. You just should do that every day for the rest of his life. So he's like 15. So you can do sumo like yeah, this. Yeah, yeah, just, <laughs> just smashing his hips into his face. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I told him. Yeah. Yeah. Dad bod. This is the fat free meal. Oh, DJ's fat free pizza? Yep. You wanna try some? It's really good. Wrapped up dinner, as you saw, I did not eat a pizookie. I'm ready for bed. I'm very tired. We're probably gonna chill out, watch TV. Tomorrow's a new day. Last day of filming with this handsome beast. Yes, sir. This sex monster. Hopefully lift some weights, probably just bench press. And then, uh, and then just hang out, I think, yeah? We're just chilling in the afternoon. We're chilling. Filming, chilling, then back home and sleep for. Mm -hmm.